We're talking, though, fresh Ono and, best of all, healthy food. That is the goal of a recipe challenge. It is issued from the Hawaii Public Health Institute. We have a slew of guests this morning. Kylene Nihipali, Jesse Lippman, and Chef Ignacio from Pono Aina Catering joining us this morning. Good morning to all of you. Good morning. Good morning. I'm going to get to your recipe really quickly, Chef. But uh, let's start with you first, Kylene. What is the Hawaii Public Health Institute for those at home who have never heard of it before? So basically, we are a hub for building healthier communities, looking at ourselves as the go to place for resources for public health policy, education, building leadership. We should talk about timing because it is a special week yes. in April right now when we're talking about fresh food. Yes, so the first week of April every year is National Public Health Week. So basically what we were looking at was what are the issues affecting public health and what is the one thing that affects each and every one of us, which is food. Of course, and we're talking yes. about fresh food, which is what we all love here in Hawaii. So let's talk about this campaign and yes. this challenge you're issuing to everybody, busy moms. We're talking dads, we're talking chefs, we're talking whether you're an amateur or you're a pro. Yes. One of the conversations we hear a lot is, I'm too busy, I have school, I have three kids at home, two full-time jobs. How do I make things that are affordable, healthy, and fresh for my family, not taking five hours to make? So we issued this challenge to be able to show people that this is possible to keep the conversation going that we can go to your local stores right down the road, grab something fresh, your farmer's markets, grab it fresh, cook it right there, then and there in less than 30 minutes and feed your ham family for affordable price. Chef, you said this took you five minutes. I'm bringing you into the conversation <laughs> now. A little bit longer, uh, yes. Uh, you can prep some of these things ahead of time, like the taro and um, sweet potato take a little bit longer, but once it's cooked and you have it bagged and refrigerated, just chop it up, and what we did here is a little hash with uh, sweet potato and taro, a little garlic and basil, and a fresh egg and some tomatoes, and just garnished with some salt and pepper and healthy, delicious. I know you're, you're entering <laughs> basically just for bragging rights. You want to enter and share yep. some of your recipes? <laughs> yep. Um, and Kylene, where can people enter? So we can go on Facebook and Instagram and just hashtag Fresh Ono Recipes as well as tagging at Fresh Ono Recipes. And we will be able to look on that and come up with some awesome prize. And we're hoping that at the end of this, that it doesn't just end with the prize or end with this week. That is something that continues on. We have Mother's Day coming up. We have a lot of different holidays and we can't afford to go out to brunches or dinners. So how can we do this at home and keep it affordable and fresh. Jesse, really quickly, we're running out of time. You got involved because this is important to the community. Right. Yeah, we work for Kokua Kalihi Valley Health Center, and food is one of the ways we bring our community together and build health. So, Chef Ignacio cooks at our Roots Cafe on School Street every Tuesday and Thursday, and people come there and eat together some of the foods we grow at the nature park in the back of Kalihi Valley at Ho'ulu Aina. So, food is a great way to connect community and build community health. Share your recipes with everyone. It's more, uh, it is. It is about the prizes, but really about bragging rights. So all this information, we went through a lot of it, is going to be on our website, which is KITV.com. Thank you for coming Thank in. You. Thanks for breakfast, Chef. I appreciate it. <laughs>